Hey, what up, Decisive Marketers? Today we're going to be talking about Story Scrapper, and this is a tool that helps you to create Google Web Stories for your WordPress website. Now, before I dive into Story Scrapper, be sure to hit that subscribe button if you like to see more digital marketing and e commerce content, right? So, here we go. So, here we are in Story Scrapper, but before I jump in, do note that Story Scrapper at the moment only works with WordPress. So you need to have a WordPress website and what it does, it creates Google Web Stories for you and Google Web Stories, they appear in the Google app under the uh, Discover tab or on uh, your Google mobile searches, right? So um, if you're on a desktop, you will probably not be able to see any Google Web Stories, uh, you know, popping up i guess um i could be wrong but i have uh, done the same search on desktop and mobile and i realized that it doesn't show up on the desktop itself so um but because google web stories is a very very new platform at the moment so a lot of people are actually getting very good results and getting a lot of traffic coming in from Google Web Stories, right? So before I dive into Google Web Stories, the first thing you need to do is to link your WordPress website. And to set this up, it's very simple. Just, you know, key in your uh, website URL, your admin username, and then the, uh, sorry, you got to select the REST API, and then put in your user application passwords, right? So if you are admin uh, user, are right, in your profile you will be able to create a user application password and then you just need to input the password in here and then you'll be able to connect your wordpress website so to create uh, google web stories using story scrapper there are two things you can do right so the first one is <coughs> the story scrapper version 4 so what to do with this, uh, you can select either bulk stories or single stories, okay? And normally, right, so they will give you, uh, so you can search for, let's say, maybe like, uh, <coughs> Hindustan Web Stories or something like that, okay? So then you will see Web Stories right here. Uh, you can click on this and then you will then be able to see uh, some web stories um, showing up right here, right? So um, you can grab this one, okay? So this is a web story. You can then uh, put in to the field here, put in the, you know, uh, your your link, okay? So when they swipe up, you know, they, you can have them land on your website. Then you can put the call to action text, uh and then if you want to remove any text from the story put in the category name all right and then uh i forgot to mention this but you need to install the uh google web stories plugin on your website okay so once you have done that uh you know you can select your website you can connect multiple websites if you want to uh, and then you can pick the one that you want and then choose the post type okay which is you know direct post and then just click on start magic it's going to pull in this web story and post it on to your website okay right then you will then be able to create a google web stories from there the other way is to make use of keyword to story okay so what you do is to enter a keyword right so it's going to search on google and uh look for stories okay that had that contains this keyword then uh scrape that and post it on your website right so all you need to do same thing just key in your swipe up link action text uh, you know, remove text from story, category name, if you want to kind of uh, tweak the look of the stories, you can do so as well, right? And then, uh, you know, choose this one, of course. And um, if you want to sort of uh, translate the text, you can do so as well, okay? And then, uh, you know, choose the post type and then start magic and then you will uh, then be able to post it 
uh, onto your website right it's pretty simple uh, there is also a old scraper if you want to use that but I don't think uh, I, I think it's all directed to the v4 right now okay and then there's a direct post record so this kind of tells you that it has been successfully posted uh, so what happens is that I put Turkey earthquake right so uh, it grabs from this website right here called meet day and then uh, repost it to my website so that's how it works okay so uh, pretty much that's how Google Web Stories work um, you know uh, sorry not Google Web Stories but Stories Gripper works okay and uh, you know a lot of people are getting very very good results from Google Web Stories uh, I highly uh, would recommend people to jump in and make use of Google Web Stories and if you want to you know uh, create content from somewhere uh, from uh, some other sources then Stories Gripper is going to come in very handy for you right so that's all I can I, I have to share for about Stories Gripper if you enjoyed this video do give me a thumbs up let me know what you think about Story Scrapper in the comments below. Lastly, if you know anyone who can benefit from Story Scrapper, be sure to share this video with them. I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye.